I'm Karen Walker. I'm Jerry Davich. And we are here at the Portage IMAX Theater reviewing two and a half minute previews for your pleasure. And that's all we're seeing is the two and a half minutes and giving you our opinion on that. Mm -hmm. Our first movie is Chernobyl Diaries. Here's a quick peek at it. Dark Swim. The wires have been destroyed. Yeah, you hear that? <gasps> it sounds like a baby. Are you sure we're out here alone? Oh my god. <sighs> Whoa, there's a lot going on there. Oh you know? yeah. It's... They're not following us, they're hunting us. They're hunting That's us. That's what we heard in and the they're clip. In a... They're in Chernobyl. It's like Cabin in the Woods. It is. It Blair is. Witch it's diaries. Russian Cabin it's in Russian, the Woods. It's exactly what it should be. There's a cabin in some Russian woods. I guess yeah. something like that. It's from the creator of Paranormal Activity. It started off though exciting, and I thought it was gonna be kind of factual based, like a documentary. Then it got all creepy, and there's little babies, and yeah, and it was a whole thriller thing. Of course, you get like twenty somethings who don't know any better. And let's no. go to Moscow. Let's go. Hey. Yeah, we're cool. Let's get a tan. So I don't know. Would you see it? Yes mm, or no? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Also. Mm. Next up is a movie called Safe. Buckle up, here it comes. Oh man, I don't know. You know, yeah, I a lot don't of testosterone know. in this one. A lot isn't of guns. It? But it's about a 12 year old girl who could decode some kind of number sequence mm -hmm. and they had to protect her in the big harsh city of New York City. Yeah, and, they and got everyone. The best, coolest detective to do this, I guess. Everyone in Asia is after this little girl. It yeah, seems. they're chasing her around. It's oh an my Asian God, girl too. yes. Everyone's chasing this lot little girl. A lot of girl. actions, a lot of violence, Tons guns, of cops. <laughs> reloading oh, yeah. the weapons, the whole Holy thing kind cow. of thing. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But since the movie's based on numbers and decoding numbers, we're going to base it, we're going to base our review on number. Mm -hmm. Zero to ten, what do you give it? Give it a zero. Four. Come on, a zero. I'm sorry, okay, maybe a two. Okay, four and a two. There you go. Next up is Pirates Band of Misfits. Arr. <laughs> <laughs> Avast! I'm the pirate captain. And I'm here for your gold. Gold? Afraid we don't have any gold, old man. This is a leper boat. So, I like this movie. That was kind of fun, wasn't it's it? It's cute. Yeah, plus it's more believable than Safe or Chernobyl Diaries. Yeah, I, mean, I, I really think it's happened, too, even yeah. though it's animation and it's pirates <laughs> and it's all pretend. It's more like believable it. than any thriller that I saw. Yeah. It looked fun. Plus you had the voices of what, Hugh Grant were in there? And Jeremy Piven. Jeremy Piven. It just looked fun and slapstick. Mm -hmm. Probably a family, of course it's a family friendly yeah, movie. Yeah, I'm taking but, my kids. But even adults such as me without little kids can go see it and have a good laugh. I oh, laughed I at the so. uh, two and a half minute trailer right off the bat. Yeah. So what do you get, yes or no? I'm going to give it a yes. We say yes, both mm -hmm. of us. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Review the Previews. I'm Karen Walker. I'm Jerry Davich. We're here at the Portage IMAX Theater. Catch you next time. Thanks for tuning in.